Happy content day. It's Thursday because it's a holiday weekend. We're getting all of our new content today. I just came from the SDS live stream and I am excited. We got the fourth inning program. We have conquest. We have a whole bunch of new cards. The moonshot event is revealed to happen right after the switch hitters event. And honestly, I'm just very, very excited about everything. I'm really, really looking forward to diving in once they push the button in literally any second now. So we're going to get Twitch rolling, get this new content rolling and i am very excited what are all of your thoughts how are we doing today what's up packers what's up bunk hello jeru thank you for the kind words hello angel and jc and harrison how are we doing i out of the three bosses they announced i think i gotta go franco but oh the matthewson card is really really kind of cool and honestly i don't know I think I gotta take that wander card, but we'll see what happens. What's up, Wise? How are we doing? I know the moonshot event. I still need to finish the switch hitters event and get those 25 wins, so I'll probably do that and some new content today, but I am very, very excited. What's up, DeBachman? The flashback Jock Peterson is incredible. I'm very excited about that. Whole lot of W's in that stream. I agree as well, Falcon. Hello, baseball. I am so hyped about that 90 plus pack at the end of the XP route. I think it's amazing in little Klee. They did little Tiki. Yo, 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 beefy. The bosses are an L, not gonna lie. I think the two hitters are good in Murray and Franco. I'm not sure about Matthewson though. I'm usually not a fan of like the longer windups from older players, but we'll see what happens. Jalen though with the eight month resub. Jalen, thank you so much and welcome back on into the sand squad sub family keep on enjoying those emotes and sub badges jalen and thank you so much for the continued support i hope you're doing well today thank you thank you thank you how is everyone doing today it looks like it is live not yet <laughs> it's getting there it's getting there they are listening to us just in to fix the hitting it's live baby we got some packs we got a whole bunch of fourth of july themes because this is fourth of july weekend that it's coming out that matthewson's gonna be discussing with pinpoint wind up might put you to sleep but those pitches controls are di and differentials are 100 percent falcon 100 percent good afternoon everyone let's go bunk moonshots coming back we'll kind of quickly go through all of this here's i'm so excited for raleigh fingers raleigh fingers became my late mvp last year for the chicago bubblegum so i will be snagging this raleigh fingers cards but in addition to raleigh fingers we got tony perez not too shabby of stats and then we got a john Smoltz starting pitcher card and Mebberts with the eight month three sub. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Mebberts, and welcome back on into the sand squad sub family keep on enjoying those emotes and sub badges and thank you so much for the continued support i hope all is well thank you thank you thank you because the eddie looks very very good it would be noticeable yeah ortiz and tommy they're here to stay but yeah that eddie looks pretty 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 amazing you'll send the moonshot i'm so excited for the moonshot hey hey y'all see what i'm seeing do you all see what I see? Do you see what I see? There's a 42 player choice pack. That is a big dub. I don't know if they went through that on stream. Maybe I just overlooked it, but this is a huge dub. If you're looking to get that 99 Jackie Robinson, that is incredible. I, we're going to do the conquest today and see if we maybe get another one in conquest. But Alex Gaming, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. I am very, very excited. And it is sellable. As you can see, there's not that no sell sign. So you can sell this if you just want the subs and you're not really looking to get the 99 Jackie right now. As for the fourth inning classics, here's Tommy Edmond obviously of course a lot of contact but not too shabby in the power department you're one win away from jason let's get it jack peterson with that 123 123 power honestly jack peterson you might want to get this card for the moonshot event you might want to get this card for the moonshot event the 90 plus is a big win cvac what's up andrew i'm doing well how are you i'm so excited i know i'm missing comments from left and right that's not very much like me but i see all your excitement i'm excited i want to make sure we digest everything and jump into everything like right now but oh my goodness, Jake with the tier one sub. Jake, thank you so much and welcome on into the sand squad sub family. Enjoy those emotes and sub badges, Jake. And thank you so much for the support. I hope you're doing well today and enjoying the new content. And Major League Mike with the Ray Tree Boy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Let me get a shout out for you 
right here right now for those of you who don't know major league mike he is a fantastic human being click that link drop him a follow you're supporting an incredible person how are we doing what's up good figgy welcome on in thank you so much major league mike i really appreciate that and we are 75 percent through a level one hype drain all the hype everyone literally all of the hype i am very excited we got a couple more 4th of July goodies, so that's exciting. Some uniforms, and here we have the bosses. I know they went through these perks on the live stream, so we'll go through these kind of quickly. Wander Franco, he's good all the way around. Christy Mathewson, that uh, control is unprecedented. It is amazing. And we all thought Eddie Murray in chat, we thought he was going to be a big L. Yeah, no, he's not. Yeah, no, Eddie Murray is not a big L. I thought I was going to take Franco and uh, um, Wander Franco immediately. Now I'm kind of between him and Murray. I need more infield help, so I think I'm going to end up going with Wander, but I might have to buy this Eddie Murray card. Gosling, I see that hydrate. Hello, 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 Major League Mike. Thank you so much for the raid. I really appreciate that. And yes, packs are half off now. They are definitely... Whoops, I just exited out. I did not mean to do that. Let's go back to where we were. And then some more packs, another classic stadium choice pack, a couple kitchen sink packs. Oh, I'll get a chance to get the Harold Baines and Adam Dunn cards for my White Sox collection, the Aloy Jimenez as well. And then, of course, what we've all been waiting for is a 90 plus live series cards. This is big for no money spent. Even if you're not no money spent, this is big, but especially for no money spent. And I do want to point something out real quick. I have close to 220,000 stubs. So, oh my God. Why did Acuna go down so much? Whoa, 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 wait. He legit was 200,000 sub, uh, stubs, excuse me. He just dropped like 60K. Do I buy him now or is he gonna drop a bit more? What do the other guys look like? Mookie dropped from 70 to 50? I literally just checked these right before their live stream. And then Tatis went down around 20K. Oh, dang! And Jake with the 200 bits. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Should we go get Acuna right now? Should we Should we wait? Oh, because the half-price packs. That is exactly right, DeBachman, because of the half-price packs. Oh, my God. This is incredible. Get the Acuna. Do we wait a little bit more? Do you think he'll go down a little bit more, or should we just buy him right now? You paid 218 the other day? Check Trout. We can definitely check Trout before I make any uh, decisions here. This is exciting. GG's to the half price packs. We might finish our live series collections after our big pack opening on Saturday. Trout went down 100K. He's still expensive, but he went down 100K. That's pretty monumental. Get him now, get him now. All right, all right, all right. And yep, we do have the new Tops Now moments. Again, because it's 4th of July weekend, because it's a holiday, we're getting all the content today on Thursday and not on Friday. Just a little FYI. Let's go put in the buy order for Acuna. Let's go do it. Let's go freaking do it. Put in the buy order. We're going to put it in at 160, 251. And see when it goes through. And you don't have to still fans of the conquest. We're going to start with the con. And there he is, folks. There he is. We need two more diamonds. And then we get Chipper Jones. How clutch is that? Holy cow, what a Thursday we're having! And it hasn't even started! Holy cow, and now we get Tom Glavin. Oh, I gotta go, I gotta go adjust the whole CBG lineup real quick. I gotta, I gotta go adjust him, adjust that lineup. This is big, folks. And baseball goat, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to Sand Squad and Q with the eight month resub thank you so much q welcome back on into the sand squad sub family keep on enjoying those emotes and sub badges and thank you for the continued support i hope all is well q i hope you're raking playing some baseball thank you thank you thank you poison clan thank you for the follow welcome to the sand squad and johnny chevy with the five gifted thank you so much scotty eric david nick and judge let me see all the thank yous in chat to johnny as i welcome you all into the sand 
squad, sub, family. Enjoy those emotes and sub badges. Make sure you give a huge thank you to Johnny first. Johnny, thank you, thank you, thank you. Friar, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Cod Life, thank you for the bit. I really appreciate that. We are 6% through a level three hype train. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We just got Acuna. I think we could get Mookie. We can get Mookie, but I do want to save for the more expensive Tatis first. Oh my God, Tatis is now 86,000. We gotta go play Conquest. We gotta go play Conquest, get some packs, get some stubs, then go play the event, because I still need to get my 25 wins. I'm like overwhelmed in the best way right now. I think this is the most overwhelmed I've been with a content drop, which is all, which is good, by the way, which is good. Cod Life with another 100 bits. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Sand Squad and DQ. Good afternoon, MLB. I'm, I'm having a moment here with everything that has come out. We are now two cards away from Chipper. This is so exciting i know i'm missing chat i'm so sorry about this let me catch up real quick because uh tatis jr is more expensive than mookie we're gonna save up for the more expensive one but it looks like he's just going to go down in price a little bit more tatis i mean he's at eighty five thousand. And then Mookie, I want to say, was at 60000 if we put in a buy order. Oh my goodness, Mookie went down to 39000 I should have waited on Acuna. I probably could have gotten like 50 k off. Wait, what happened to Moncada? Yoan hurt himself again? How did he hurt himself, dude food? Oh my goodness. But Major League Mike with the 500 bits. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Major League Mike. I really appreciate that. And once again, thank you so much for the raid. You are the best. We need to play Conquest. We need to just uh, take a deep breath. So breathe in through your nose. Breathe out through your mouth. Let's go play some Conquest. And then when we're done with Conquest, we might be able to finish our collections today. We might be able to finish our collections today, which is beyond excited oh or should we do the tops now first we'll do the conquest first we can save tops now we can save tops now he heard himself sliding to third oh no oh no jake with the 45 bits thank you so much there's so much going on i know i know i know i see that hydrate packers sounds sweaty let's do it do we have any particular goals we don't have to steal fans that is a huge plus i'm seeing right now and there's no particular order of which strongholds we have to take over first so let's go on over to washington here let's make our way to dc and take over those nationals i see that hydrant agt i will get that in one moment deep breaths deep breaths you paid 60k for Mookie yesterday. You should have waited. Right? It's all good, though. He's all good. He's staying in the game. Good. Thank you for those updates, dude food. Here's the Hydrate AGT. What's up, Ooplies? I am just overwhelmed in literally the best way. Literally the best way. I still... We are going to work on events the rest of the weekend. Don't worry. We will get those 25 wins for Jason Dominguez. For those of you who don't know that reference, that was a Jason Derulo reference. And I blame Dude Food. That was his title last night. And it literally has not escaped my mind. But I'm so excited. Slid over his hand somehow. Ooh. Ooh. That is interesting. Two months already. Corrupt Snake with the two-month resub. Two months, that flies by very, very quickly, Corrupt Snake. Thank you so much, and welcome back on into the Sand Squad sub family. Keep on enjoying those emotes and sub badges, and thank you so much for the continued support, Corrupt Snake. I really, really appreciate that, and hope you're really well. Thank you, thank you, and Major League Mike with 100 more bits. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We are hyped for this drop. We are 47% through a level 3 hype train. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Jake with 95 bits. I really appreciate that, Jake. Thank you so much. Let's get these dubs going. Let's go start off this stream with a dub against the Nationals. So if you are a Nationals fan, you might want to just root for the CBG today. Let's get this game going. We are going to play it on Hall of Fame. No big deal. But let's make sure we get the dub and we are going to send out Corbin Burns. I know, do y'all hear Ramon talk about the shark map? I'm excited because Shark Week is coming up. It's coming up. I spoil my peeps. I appreciate you, Mike. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And thank you all for completing a level two hype trend. You all are seriously the best. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You pulled Acuna today? GG's. That 90 plus pack is like the biggest dub 
of my life. And Rips with the eight month resub Rips. Thank you, thank you, thank you, and welcome back on Into the Sand Squad Sub Family. Keep on enjoying those emotes and sub badges, and thank you for eight incredible months of support, Brips. I really appreciate that and hope you're doing well. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh my goodness, give us the shark map, right? You would like to formally wish everyone a happy Bobby Bonilla Day, right? He's getting his bag for oh, today and many more years to come. We've got the Moonshot event coming on the 9th. So let's get our 25 wins. Let's get Jason Dominguez on a leadoff home run, even though that was Marcus Simeon, but that was in my head. We'll get Dominguez with the event, and then we'll go play the Moonshot. I don't know when I'm going to have time to play ranked seasons, so we're going to put that on the back burner for now. Happy Grizz Davis Day. What's the easiest way to beat Conquest? Um, If you're comfortable playing on All-Star and Hall of Fame, and you, can, and you can get those dubs, you'll be able to basically play any game and get those dubs rather easily. You have 17 wins in the event right now? No, I have eight, so I gotta work. I gotta get some progress going. Gotta get some progress going, so we will make sure to do that. Do you think the live series players will go back up in price after the half price packs? 100%, yes. Simeon just absolutely matched that baseball. I believe that was the first pitch of the game. I didn't even put on the home run chain. I'm all over the place. Can't forget to put on the home run chain. Try to oppo taco that with Jim Tomey. Wasn't there though. Packs today instead. I do not have like enough packs to qualify for a good pack opening. Don't worry, we'll have a good one on Saturday. But we'll see what happens. You got your first two wins in the event today. GG's please. Let's go, Jake. Thank you so much. A 41 overall Mickey is in the game for the Orioles. He throws a knuckleball sinker and four seam just in time for the moonshot, which is always what, like lefty righty hitters against common pitchers. So be aware. I might have to throw him in my rotation. No, I'm kidding. When do the half price packs end? I'm not sure. I didn't realize there were half price packs until I believe Ramon stated it in the live stream. And thank you for that heads up, Falcon. I appreciate that. You're a mad Yankees fan. These events are gonna drive you insane. You're on a 12 game losing streak. It's all good OG Luckily the losing streak doesn't mean anything. They just keep track of your wins if you can snag those 25 Ends on the six you believe. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Think they said Tuesday If you get Trout or DeGrom out of the 90 plus back, I will cry. Me too, little Klee Maybe dude food finally has a chance to pull Trout's the Angels with a comeback victory. I was very, very happy with the Angels. That was that was amazing. And way to back up your ace after a very rare bad outing for him. We're going to have runners on the corners here with two outs. Let's get some insurance runs as we make progress. Magic 8-Ball says no chance. Shroud down to 401 now. I should have waited for Acuna. I probably could have gotten him uh, for a couple, couple tens of thousands of subs cheaper, but it's okay. If y'all want to keep tabs on Tatis and Mookie for me, I would appreciate it. Walsh saved it for the Angels last night. That he did. That he did. All right, everyone. We have a very slim 1-0 lead. Let's make sure we take it. Get our first dub of the stream and get a whole bunch of packs for Saturday. Chase with a one bit. Thank you so much. How do you get the 90 plus pack? You have to finish the fourth inning program, which means you need to accumulate between now and about a month from now, 650,000 experience. It sounds like a lot, but if you play this game a few hours every couple of days throughout the Got week, him. you should be able to get there. What is this mode called? Actually, Conquest. We are playing Conquest. You got a PlayStation 5 today? GG's, Cody. Let me get my emotes out here for you. GG's. That's amazing. I'm doing very well, Thunder. Glad to hear that you're doing well. I am just very, very happy right now with everything that's going on. I will say when they first announced the bosses besides Wander, I was a little disappointed. I'll be honest with you all. And then I saw all the stats. I saw the attributes. And I'm like, this is a dub round. This is a pretty dub. And then you were sad. Hey, at least you got Acuna, though. That's a big pull. Note to anyone wanting experience worth doing the U.S. Conquest map again is now you'll get all the prospect cards for completing it at once. I feel like you're subtweeting me there, Golden Brady. I still need to do the Conquest map. And honestly, I respect the subtweet there. <laughs> Have I looked at the Daily Moments program? I did not do that on stream, but I did do that uh, on my own right before stream. I'm a big fan of the Nelson Cruz card. 403 now, dang. Because it has to update. It updated rather quickly for me. It took like 5, 10 minutes. Eh, 10 minutes. Yep, don't forget to do your daily. It's two hits against Garrett Cole with Lou Gehrig. It wasn't too bad of a daily. It took like three hours to download. Oh, dang. 
Hopefully it's almost there can, so you can play all of this. Uh, Kriff Kind, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. How we doing? Will the other third-inning bosses spike now for the collection or are they fall into? Usually they'll probably spike a little bit for this collection, but I, I would imagine they would even out in a couple of days. <laughs> no subtweet intended, but your conscience caught it apparently. You're good, Brady, and it did, it did. All I think about is the US Conquest map. It lives in my mind rent-free. I gotta, I gotta fix that. You pulled Trout GG's, Jaden. All the hype there. That is rather exciting. Thank goodness Simeon had that leadoff homer because I'm too excited to properly focus and hit in this game at the moment. Let's get down to business. Let's get down to business to defeat the show. Name the movie. You're doing the Tops Now since you enjoy the Tops Now program. Let's go. You pulled Shroud. That is just amazing. Y'all are doing Tops Now moments. I decided to jump into the Conquest only because I need to make sure to finish it before Saturday because I don't have as many packs as I would like Mulan. Watch the Philly stink in the Madras and negative three IQ. Yeah, that is very frustrating. Very, very frustrating for the organization and its fans. Yeah. What's up, Blaze? How are we doing today? Did it two and a half times before they made the change, so I have to do half again to get the final products. That stinks, Bruce. Easy dogs, absolutely. We gotta make sure our pitching is up to par here, cause our hitting is not. <laughs> yeah, let's warm up another righty. Let's get Romo some action, or not Romo, uh, Goose some action. Bunk you in here, what's up DeGroosh? How we doing? Taking all the dubs, we always take all the dubs. We take any and all dubs we can get, for sure. You ever pull his belly, now he's worth 30K, holy. It's because of the half price packs, but don't worry, the prices will go back up. But if y'all are closing in on your collections, it is a perfect long weekend to get your collections done. Or at least some significant progress on said collections. That's what I'll be doing. Um, I am convincing myself I will have Chipper Jones uh, before I bid you all an adieu on Saturday for the weekend. The event is so annoying you can't win anything, anything you're so bad at hitting. I'm sorry to hear that, Free Trust. It's definitely an annoying event because you know everyone's playing it. So it's bringing out all types of players. But hopefully you can get those 25 wins. You got a week, a little over a week, a week and, uh, week and a day. But hopefully you can get this. Um, I believe until Tuesday, T-Baseball. Punk and I will need a minute. You you take all the time you need to Grouch. <laughs> thank you, Oobly. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I think you'll have to pretend night the way it's going. Yes! We gotta make it happen. I gotta keep tracking down those prices. And honestly, Ramon reminded me, I have so many diamond ball player perks that I just haven't sold. I haven't really uh, worked on that ball player mode too often this year. So I could always sell those perks and I will guarantee myself most likely finishing collections today. You just moved your room to the basement today. Ooh, hopefully get some more space. Super Factor Larry secured. Let's go. Do you, do you hold any subs back for investments or finish off some of the collections? Investments, I'll usually pick one or two cards. I don't go too far into investments. It's usually like five to ten max I'll put into a card. But because I'm so close with the collections, I only need Tatis Jr. I only need Mookie Betts. I'm going to put all my subs to those cards. Um, Blue, thanks for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. I hope you know Black Lives Matter and Blue is just a uniform, not a life. We got a thousand Biggios. There you go. Did I see the 99 Trey Turner you made on Discord? I don't think so, but I will make sure to check that once I get off stream today. You got all 40 wins last night? GG's, Master Chief. Look at you go. Look at you go. As Marcus splits one into the left center field gap, he is on fire two for two with two extra base hits. You'll love to see it. My day is growing amazing, Blaze. How is your day going? Uh, dog, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. How are we doing today? We are just on fire. Am I going to try to complete the entire event or just get to Dominguez? Just get to Dominguez. That is the goal here. So if it takes us until the end of the event to get Dominguez, then it takes us to the end of the event. If we get Dominguez by the end of the weekend, then maybe we'll play a couple more event games, but the goal itself is definitely get those 25 wins. If we can play anything extra, then it's just extra stuff, which might help with experience for the new program. You have 50 weekend, weekers, excuse me, and 150 nakins, let's go. That 
I don't even know how we had that much contact. Look at the PC where the PCI was. That ball should not have traveled that far. You're ready for your long weekend? Same. I feel ya. I feel ya. You don't normally buy packs, but 37,500 for 50 isn't bad for a chance at 10 diamonds. True, 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 true. Dang it, Trout. We need a better swing than that. Bring back the 99 trade tuner cycle card from last year. That'd be pretty cool. I, I had to break my own rule for that T Red. I had to. It just didn't make sense. What's up, Richard? How we doing today? To be honest. Yeah, I'm excited. We will eventually get to those tops now moments. If we don't get to them today, we will definitely get to them tomorrow, most likely. If not, we can always save them. They're not going anywhere, so we can work on the new event. You're good. Glad to hear, Richard. I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. You just pulled Tatis. Let's go. But you're torn since you have since you've had Abrams from the start. At the very least. A bench bat is really, really iconic for those. Thoughts on the bosses? I'm pretty happy with them. I didn't expect to be happy with them when they were first announced, besides the uh, Wander card, of course. But then I saw all of the stats, and I think it's a big dub. I do. I think it's a dub. I'm doing well, Random Rocker. How are you doing, Jordan? I hope all is well. You need to spend a day just to do all your Tops Now moments? Yes! You're gonna want to, trust. When the monthly program comes out next week, you're gonna, you're gonna want those Tops Now cards. Tatis rakes, you'd start Tatis over Abrams. Tatis is good, you have him super fractor and he hits nukes. Big upgrade over Abrams, oh glad to know. I feel that it's always hard to get rid of a card, especially when you've done so well with them. You feel like you're like disrespecting them when you put them on your bench. I, I totally understand Jacoby Ellsbury was in my starting lineup for the longest time last year. And then I finally replaced him when we got the finest Cody, we got Trout. Uh, uh, Mickey Mantle and Ken Griffey Jr. And it was a pretty sad day. But they were still there on the bench. Parallel 5 Tatis is 99 speed as well. That's a big dub. Love to see it. Ooh, I think that's our first hit for the opponent. Us Preds fans are a mess right now. Oh, wait, what happened with the Predators, DeGroosh? I may have missed that. Got a Tops Now card. Gives us an 11 game hit streak. Keep in mind, Tops Now. I believe it's still true. You can you can double check with the dates. They're always a week behind. So the tops now for today wasn't from this most recent late week. It's from the last week. The Suns are in the finals. Hopefully the Bucks will join them in a couple of games. Big game five tonight for Milwaukee. And well, and Atlanta. But with home court advantage, Bucks really need to pull out a win tonight. Gives Bunk a big hug. Bunk! You're angry. What happened? What happened with the Preds? Let me know. Let me know. As hopefully we'll come down with this catch with Santana and get our first dub of the Conquest map. You just got 15 strikeouts in the San uh, Santalon 6 any moment. There you go. Arvidsson got traded. Where do you get traded to? I know you're a Bucks fan, but I'm rooting for the Hawks. Disrespectful. Disrespectful. I, I see you. I see you. Um, AC, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. LA for a couple of picks. Guess who's playing third for the Sox right now? Gavin Sheets. I have no idea. Suns in four. They don't even know their opponent yet. It looks like the market has leveled off. Mookie's at 40k. Thank you for letting me know. Do we know? Do we have any updates on Tatis? We are gonna probably go and take over the Cardinals right now. Oh dang! There's a lot of teams in this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We have seven more teams. Dang. Close, Andrew Vaughn. Oh my. Andrew Vaughn's playing third base. Wow. Good for him. Why did they put like Leary or someone over there? I think I would actually be fine with Leary in the lineup at third base. He did pretty well uh, when Yo Yo was out those couple of days when he didn't feel too well. All right, let's go take over these Reds though. But yeah, go Bucks, Red Sox. Right, Leary got scratched today. He was supposed to start. Ooh, I missed that. I missed that. Let's keep Corbin in here. Yo, what's up, Boiler? Hope you're doing well. Intentionally plunks him. There's no need for that. There's no need for that. The White Sox made their statement when they crushed the Twins 13-3 yesterday. There's no need to hit players. I think uh, the win does a lot more. The wind does a lot more, but hope all is well. Valencia! We got so much content today! And we got Acuna, so now we're just two diamonds away from Chipper, and we are living life large here. My favorite fourth inning, Bros, I really like the Wonder card. I really, really do. 
So I will most likely take Wander, but the Eddie Murray isn't too bad. So who knows? If I struggle with Tomi a little bit down the stretch, we might be getting the Murray card. But yeah. The Tops now dropped today. They did. I'm assuming because it's a holiday weekend with the 4th of July on the Sunday. That's why, like, the live streaming content came out today. Because I'm assuming the workers have off on Friday and Monday over at the studio. Because well, even though the live streams are pre-recorded, there's Colin who's kind of setting up the whole live stream as it's happening. So that's why I think it was today and not tomorrow. <laughs> there you go, Falcon. You pulled Rizzo out of a pack this morning. The headliner Rizzo. GG's. Oh my goodness, Mike Trout, Apo Taco! Mike Trout, Apo Taco, everyone, let's go. Welcome back, Zavi. Your wife got you a, st a snow cone with gummy bears, but it's not helping you with the pain. I'm so sorry to hear that, Degroosh. I feel that, like, that one Panarin was traded, like, my soul was crushed. I do, Little Giant, I do like Tomi a tad bit better than, uh, Big Poppy. Nothing against Big Poppy, he is on my bench. But Tomi's getting the work done for us. You and almost all the first basemen, they're bad at fielding. You really won't find any first baseman with good fielding until we saw that uh, Eddie Murray card. If we get a couple more runs, that'd be great. Yo, Aiden with the one bit. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're doing a glitch. I would not advise it. Keep the hits coming. It's going well, CK Diddies. How are you doing today? With the half price packs, headliners will go down too since you'll pull them in the show packs as well. Absolutely. Very sound logic there. I agree. Vladdy! Does he go Oppo Taco? I think he will. He did! Back to back, Oppo Taco two run blast. We are in such a good mood. We are crushing it. Let's keep it up. Matt Olsen's a good fielder. He definitely is. I didn't ruin her, mean to, oh no, you're good, Valencia. I saw it before you posted it. And then I got to like literally not even two paragraphs and I'm like, yeah, uh, not today, not today. Big Poppy acts like a gold glove playing first. Well, that's good to hear. Wish you luck on the 50 packs you just bought. Well, I wish you luck. I wish you luck. Yeah, right? Right, Valencia, you're so sad we won't get a Jacoby card this year. Yeah. Jacoby raked for me. He was a CBG MVP. And that is that. Playing the new Conquest? Same. What's up, Yella? Sand Squad, Sand Squad, Sand Squad. You're up 250 two bucks against didn't get zero diamonds. Save those stubs and actually buy them on the marketplace. You're going to save stubs overall by doing that and not going toward the packs. You feel like the bucks are going to play like Wildfire Tie? When Giannis tweeted that, I'm like, oh, it's on. Oh, it's on. When Giannis was like, this is our house, be loud tonight, it's on. I'm excited, she said. I'm excited. I'm trying not to get, you know, not too high, not too low. But I feel like they they will, at the very, whether they win or lose this game, they should not start flat like they did the past two games. And I think that will, that will say a lot in terms of how they'll progress throughout the four quarters. Easy catch. For a first year fan, you're a hype. I'm always hype. Well, I'm not first year. I watched the past two years, but it was, again, a little bit more casual than, like, into it. But it's all good. Doesn't matter if you've been a fan for one day or your whole life. You can get hyped. Oh, okay. No, I, I, I swear. I swear. I was pretty casual for the past two years, but then I decided to really get into it because, like, I had the time to because of COVID-19. It's gonna be crazy, not gonna lie. Absolutely. You just had the pitcher in the face. He got taken out of the game. Yo, that happened against me the other day. It happened on the MLB stream. And I was kind of shook, to say the least. You had 1.25 mil and all your collections done. You did it for fun, so you lost. Uh, losing 50k is no big deal. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Always want to make sure y'all are safe and sound with your collections. And of course, spend your stubs no matter how you wish to spend your stubs. I'm a big advocate of unfinishing your collections first. And then, of course, spoil yourself whatever you want. It's tough when you need to try and have under 100k to resist the half price packs, as that feels more of a, an attainable chance to get to him. I totally under the, understand that perspective, 100%. Try to trick your mind by playing Conquest, assuming one of these packs will have him. Get those experience for the 90 plus pack, and hopefully, something good comes out of it soon. But yes, I will not disagree that those packs are not tempting. They are very much tempting. Tempting Chicken with the Twitch Prime sub. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Chicken. And welcome on into the Sand 
squad, sub, family. Enjoy those emotes and sub badges. And thank you for the support, chicken. I really, really appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hope all is well today. You just won your first game on Hall of Fame. G to the G. That is a big accomplishment and a big momentum push going forward. Very, very exciting stuff. We're playing all these Conquest games on Hall of Fame. Obviously, a little bit different Hall of Fame and Conquest than it is in ranked seasons, but still excited nonetheless. Shroud is always in the next pack. Oh, of course. Of course. It's going to be Scherzer Central. I would not be surprised, but at least it gives you a chance at Shroud when the 85 to 89 pack gives you an exactly 0% chance at Shroud. But yeah, welcome in and check in. Absolutely. The 90 plus pack is a win. I agree. It's going well, Rogue. How are you doing today? You pulled Trout, DeGrom, and Tatis in all-in-one opening. That is big clutch. You didn't bring wild pack luck. You only work pack luck for me. I don't make the rules. It's just it's just how it is, Valencia. Ben's rendition to the Sand Squad yesterday was very, very funny. I agree. Only you. Exactly. Exactly. Flirty, you might have gotten killed in your last event game from a line drive. Oh, my. It's in your contract. As it should be. As it should be. I remember writing it there. At least we know we won't be getting the disappointing feeling when you get when you see the purple. Oh, for sure. For sure. Savannah. You can't win in ranked. That's a big mood. Can't complain. Got Subway Series tickets for Sunday. Enjoy, Rogue. Hope that's a very fun uh, game for you. Saturdays are for the packs. Too bad it's Thursday. <laughs> What's up, CJ? Hope all is well. We're just going through this conquest game right now, trying to get as many packs as possible. Just buying some packs. If y'all are buying packs, let me know if you get any good pulls. I live vicariously through all of you who do buy packs. You got two Schwarbers. What's up, Miami? Hope all is well. Yankees better when they need it. Yeah, very interesting season so far for the Yankees. Not the best swing, but it works. You're at seven diamonds so far. Best one has been Hershizer. Not too shabby. Got a high dive in there in Hirsch. His price should go back up, I'm assuming, once the half price packs are over. One. You're going to a Mets game Tuesday. Have fun. One, About three one. Matt Olsons for 5,500 subs. If he goes 90 plus, which he will, he'll rise 15,000 subs. That's a, that is a fantastic investment to Bachman. Very disappointing to say the least. You just pulled Trout. GG's ballin'. That is incredible. Enjoy. Enjoy. Um, that's gonna be caught, but we will tag up the the leading runner and push him to third base rather easily. We got runners on the corners, two outs. Let's see if Jim Tomey can break through here and push another run across the plate. You got Degrom. Let's go. The Pablo nope, Sandoval card. I think the Daily Moments this is the best Daily Moments program we've seen thus far. I'm very excited about it. I will say, I wish you can just like quick sell the duplicate rewind cards because I'm gonna end up having like three of several of them. We'll see what happens though. We just missed that pitch. These are good. Let's go. You got another trout? You're messing with me. You're messing with me. You just hit five homers on very early time with the PCI nowhere near the ball. Meanwhile, you're hitting, you had good timing ball in the middle of the PCI. I popped out to the catcher three times. That is very, very frustrating. I'm sorry to hear that, OG. That is never very fun. Or fair. Billy missed two bunts righty righty and then lined out. Why, why does he always get the bun sign? Tony needs to like chill out because Billy can hit home runs. But he is also back from the IL. But still, it's Billy. We love Billy. I want to see him hit homers. M3 is gifting a sub to be free. Oh, my God. That is perfect. M3, be free. You're amazing, uh, M3. Thank you so much. And be free. Welcome on into the Sand Squad sub family. Enjoy those emotes and sub badges. But make sure you give M3 a big old thank you first. Thank you so much, M3. That's very, very kind of you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Good afternoon, NY Giants fan. How are you doing this afternoon? We're getting through this conquest map, trying to get as many as uh, much of this map done as possible so that we can get all the packs that come from it. And Kingdoms with the five month three sub Kingdoms. Thank you so much and welcome back on into the Sand Squad sub family. Keep on enjoying those emotes and sub badges. And thank you so much for the continued support, Kingdoms. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. No worries at all, Matthew. I'm just glad you can make it. How are you doing today? 
You want to see Billy hit a triple and tag up on an infield fly? Yes, that would make my day. And Billy, Billy wants that inside the park home run. So hopefully he can get that too before his career will eventually end. Because that would be amazing for him. You have like three or four Giambis right by now. Same here, Debachman. I feel like I have three of them. We'll see what happens though. Baseball boy, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Hope all is well this afternoon. We're just working our way through these conquest games. At a pretty good pace too, might I add. And then we will resume the event tomorrow, I should make clear. We will resume the event tomorrow. What am I playing on? We are, I am playing on the PlayStation 5, and we're currently doing some conquests. The new one. The new one. Wait, Kingdoms! Subscribe again? Yo, Kingdoms! I don't know if that was a glitch, but I got two uh, resubs from you. Regardless, thank you so much. I got a Twitch Prime and a Tier 3 5 months. I'm assuming one of them will go through, so thank you so much once again, Kingdoms, and welcome back on in the Sand Squad sub family. Keep on enjoying those emotes and sub badges, and thank you, thank you, thank you for the continued support. I truly, truly appreciate it. And Aiden with the tier one sub. Aiden, thank you, thank you, thank you, and welcome on into the Sand Squad sub family enjoy those emotes and sub badges and thank you for the support aiden i hope all is well and bobby thank you for the follow welcome to the sand squad hope you are doing well thank you so much kingdoms i appreciate it no matter what thank you thank you thank you rb's coming in five minutes we need those curly fries people is Aaron Judge? Sheesh, keep it going. Any good Conquest packs? We, I think we've come across a standard pack. We're on our second stronghold at the moment. I'll let you know when we get anything good, for sure, for sure. For the time being, we got a nice 4 nothing lead. Byron Buxton looking to add some more. And add to his parallel staff. But because we're leading, we should win this game. And Mr. C1313 with the Twitch Prime sub. Thank you so much, Mr. C. And welcome on into the Sand Squad sub family. Enjoy those emotes and sub badges. And thank you for the support. I really appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you indeed. With that being said. Vladdy gaps one over there. To left center field. And we are just going to run into some outs now. So we can get th through this conquest map. Before I have to end stream today. Yep, he tagged him right there. Bunk is amazing. Have a fantastic uh, night. Uh, afternoon at work Bunk. And thank you so much for stopping by. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. Who are the bosses? We have Matthewson, Franco, and Murray. And they're all kind of lit cards. Not going to lie. 15 more packs, here we go. Best of luck to you. Best of luck. All right, let's end this game and keep the good times rolling. Oh, I need to add um, Glavin into this. Starting rotation, but I do have to mess with ranked seasons first, make sure someone is at full energy. That's an out. Safe, the ball beat him. Just got home from food shopping with your mother-in-law. You just hurt your paycheck. I'm sorry to hear that, Kingdoms, but hopefully you got some good food. Probably wander, T-Breezy, but what are you? What are you thinking? Tops now moments are done. Let's go, T-Rad. Oh, no. We're gonna have to look for a robbery here. Jump too early. That 99 pitcher is gross. I agree. But you need a new shortstop. All right, we better be careful here. Might want to take Franco out of the game, to be honest. And uh, we will. Let's bring in Dennis. Lock this game down. And T Breezy, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Oof, it's all good. It happens. That's that's why we get a a, a four run lead, so that that doesn't hurt us. That Homer. A little easier to time, but it seems too difficult. Well, we you're supposed to jump once that top arrow is green, which we did. But we were still too early on the jump. It's all good, though. Tops on a Thursday. Yeah, I think it's because of the holiday weekend. They just gave us all the content today. I think that's also why the inning program dropped today instead of, like, what it usually does on Fridays because it's a holiday weekend. But, yes, Tops now are out. Got a lot of pork chops and steaks. Gotcha. Bucks and Rob's everything right. We do love content. 
You robbed four this year? Let's go. I think I've robbed four or five last year and three this year so far in home runs. So not too shabby overall. Oh, Aiden with the one bit. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Conquest is going to take you forever. Conquest is typically a grind, but in my opinion, it's definitely worth it. Monthly predictions. Definitely an Olsen and a Schwarber. I thought Schwarber was going to be the lightning card, but Olsen might be a better one. But I think I'll stick with the Schwarber predi prediction, but we'll see what happens. All right, GG's. Another win in the books. Got a headliner to be the Nationals. Thanks you for letting me know. You've had a hundred rob during moments, right? Me too, Meberts. Me too. Ooh, I would love a new Trey Turner. Absolutely, Mikey. Trey is incredible. He's so underrated this season too, I feel. GG's, everyone. Let's fix the headband and keep on moving on. Justin, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Got a, we got a set 12 headliner after beating the Reds here. Simulate a 3v3. I did not see that to Bachman. Both triangles of headliner packs. Nice. We did lose that one. Let's make our way down this line. You got Trout Underground left for collections. Who should get first? The most expensive one, so Trout, in my opinion. When you finally pull a good diamond. <laughs> Stadium pack! Did we get a stadium pack? I didn't realize it. I kind of need it. I'm not done with the diamond stadiums yet in terms of collections. No, not yet. You got Dominguez! Let's go, Justin! I'm at eight wins. We'll play some more event games tomorrow. What console do I play on the PlayStation 5? Matthewson would be the obvious choice if I wasn't for his 10 minute wind up. Oh no, you're fine, Tihoff. I didn't even see it the other time. So thank you for sending it until I noticed it. I, I agree with that statement. Are the hidden rewards the same or random for everyone? They are the same for everyone. The 97 Panda looks juicy, absolutely. I'm excited about the daily moment cards this this month. Should we go after the Cardinals or start going toward the Cubs and the Rangers? I think we'll start going towards the Cubs and the Rangers. I think that's what we'll do here. Can't wait for ranked games to take five ever with Matthewson. Oh goodness, I am not looking forward to that either. You'd rather drive your way to Arby's and watch Matthewson throw baseball. Okay, that pack opening was great. You end up with two Trouts, a DeGrom, a Tatis, a Judge, a Mookie, and two Will Smiths. Wow. Make sure you don't... I don't want to tell you what to do, but just keep in mind that the prices will go back up after the pack sale. So then you can make more of a profit if you're going to sell any duplicates. Nelson has to be a bench bat versus lefties. No contact versus righties, unfortunately. Oh, absolutely a bench bat, but a good one. Does your main screen in Dynasty show uh, Yount as a boss or does have Franco now? Ooh. I don't know. Here we go. You're never a fan of Cruz because of the swing. Time to face the Reds. There you go. Oh, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Should we go after the Cubs? And yeah, we can do this. Let's go over here. Let's take over this corner and then let's go face the Cubs. What's up, Joe? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yo, what's up, Bilardo? I'm doing very, very well. We're doing the new 4th of July conquest map in the new inning program. We're off to a fantastic start. We're about to take over those Cubs. Very, very beast. Excited about the new excited about the new bosses? I am. I am. Sills over on the sixth right. I that's what chat's been telling me, and I, I trust chat. Any advice for making stubs? There is so much. Investments, conquest, showdown, literally just playing the game will help you a lot. Obviously, of course, some modes are better than others in terms of making stubs. Conquest is probably your go-to in terms of a game mode. It's back down to 86k. Exciting, it's exciting. Playing rank gives a tons of stubs, that's true, especially with the uh, program for rank seasons. All right, let's reinforce. Oh, we can't because it's cut off right here. That's okay. We can just reinforce right here.
There's a Scherzer pull. <laughs> You'd be able to do both. Wind up starts, drive to Arby's, go in the restaurant, order, pick it up, take it home, go back to your console, swing, home run, all in the same pitch. Oh, 100%. With the Matthewson lineup. All right, let's keep these dubs rolling. The true easiest way to get stubs is the credit card. That That is 100% true. The easiest, quickest, fastest way to get subs is your credit debit card. You bought 200 Jesse Winkers waiting for him to go diamond, which he should. May you see the squad, shoot. Yes, there it is. <laughs> now they're bunting to Vaughn. The disrespect, what's the score right now? They're up 3-2. Two minutes ago. He has a bruised right hand, yo-yo. Dang. Come on, Marcus. They all take my mom's credit card. Just lost your job. The new Indian program is about to up your energy right now. I'm very, very sorry to hear that, Bilardo. Please let me know if you need anything. Hopefully you can have a nice little escapism in this Indian program. I know we can all use that from time to time. Could be a Lefty Grove boss. I actually enjoy Lefty Grove. He's like the one long windup that I truly don't mind. We just missed that pitch with Simeon. That's a bit disappointing. That was not too bad of a swing either. You should buy 201 because then you can quick sell the 200 for the million stubs. Ooh. That's true. All right, come on, Michael Nelson Trout. There it is from Trouty. There it is. Let's go. He's like, Simeon, you just missed a homer. Don't worry. I'll hit a perfect, perfect homer for you. Let's go, Trout. Come on, Jim. Keep it rolling here. What parallel do I have Simeon at? I believe he's three. I believe he's three. Bad woman was horrible, but made half your stubs back. You'll get the rest off conquest. There you go. It's a great way to look at it. Let's go, Jake. You're so bad at hitting right now. It happens. We all get into little funks. Did I hear about the Mets last night? I don't think so. You have 400 jazzes in the next three to four updates. Jazz will go gold. At least 400k made. Yes. I have a lot of Jesse Winkers and Cedric Mullins just from opening up packs. So I'm excited for when they get their upgrades. Lost two to 20. Oh my, I did not see that at all. But it's all good. It's, it's one game. There's 162 total. Outside. Of course, it's always hard when those games happen, but just know in baseball You literally have the next day to turn things around which is a very helpful mindset and truth to the sports Just got bucks in parallel four. You just lost your job. You're about to buy subs and you got fired Oh my goodness p -walk. I'm very very sorry to hear that as well as to you. Please let us know if you need anything Stack down Verdugo and Segura. There you go. If Biggio for some flu goes gold 1 million stubs You'd be happy to invest in someone right now, but you want to buy Acuna to keep making progress on Chipper. I feel KR. I was just able to buy Acuna today, and now I'm just Mookie and Tatis away from Chipper. So hopefully you can get Acuna soon. He has dropped in price because of the pack sales, as well as the rest of the live series diamonds, if you didn't know that already. But to sell him to finish collections, also want to kind of keep him. What do you do? Um, You could at the very least try out his card once you get him. If you like him, cool. Keep him. If you don't, get those subs. Jesse Winker's name sounds like the nerdy kid in movies that gets shoved in his locker all the time. Dang, Valencia. Why don't you tell that to his face? Your Mike Trout away from Chipper feels bad. We gotta get you some luck for that 90 plus That's overall pack when you finish the inning program. That's a ball. We have to think into or talk into existence. Mike Trout pulls for all of you all who don't have him already. But it is good that the 50% the 50 off pack sales did drop Trout's price by like 100k. Obviously, he's still very expensive, but it's 100k you don't have to worry about now. Just pulled 500 packs. Didn't see him once. Oof. I always recommend. I know packs are obviously more exciting. Save the stubs from packs. Packs, in my opinion, especially if you haven't finished collections, are truly not worth it. If you buy them. Obviously, if you earn them free. You have the right to hope. I mean, you have the right to hope, of course, when you buy them. But to save those stubs, I feel you have an even better chance to buy him than pull him. But the excitement is always there, which makes it difficult. You pulled the wrong fish. It was Tim Salmon. The disrespect of Tim Salmon. You know, Cunha, DeGrom, and Trout for Chipper. Who am I going to get for the fourth inning program? Most likely Wander, which I'm very excited about. You sold all your duplicates to raise stubs. It's hard. Absolutely, it's difficult. 
You just need to goat now for Chipper? Yo, one diamond away. How exciting. I'm two. I'm two. I'm getting there. You got your second dose of the Moderna vaccine tomorrow. You feel nervous? No need to be nervous at all. I got Moderna. I got my first shot in April, my second shot in May. And I was very fortunate. I literally had no side effects. Drinking a whole bunch of water and moving around really, really helped me personally. Acuna, DeGrom, and Trot away too. Well, I'm hoping you all the best of uh, pack vibes and pack luck. What conquest is this? The new fourth inning program conquest. The American flag. Oh, that's Pfizer gang gang. Price uh price drop today. Put all you need just below how much you have. So on a buying stream. Chipper tonight. Let's get it, MJ. I might have Chipper after our big pack opening on Saturday. Which I'm very excited about. Oh, that pitch is out. For those of you who don't know, we do big pack openings every Saturday. We just get a whole bunch of packs simply by playing the game. So we save every Saturday to open them all up. And it's it makes for quite an exciting time. Um, ND State Champ, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. How long half the packs are going the half packs are going for? I believe until the six, people were saying. You almost have Jupiter Pro at five. Let's go, Pfizer fam. <laughs> for life. You're all in on the 90 plus pack, super hyped for it. Same. Just to have that chance to pull a trout is really, really neat. Tune well, Vikas. How are you doing? Have you had the chance to check out the new content yet? The White Sox are playing right now? That they are. You opened five headliners, got Evans two times. You have the best pack luck. GG's. That is incredible. Of course, Railroader. I got gotcha. you. The offense has slowed down a little bit here, so let's get it going. Yes, Pfizer, Moderna, we're all team 5G. Yes, Moderna gang. Do you think David Justice David Justice will go down even more? Ooh. There's a chance. I think there's a chance. But it does seem around this moment prices are evening out from the price drop. But who knows, to be honest. Big Poppy had a rock a uh, Grand Slam walk-off in ranked seasons for you. GG's Alex. That's a lot of hype. Uh Slick, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. We got Carlos Santana betting 500 against the CPU in Hall of Fame, so that's exciting. Too early on that fastball. Vita Blue 100 k yo. A Scott card this year? I have no idea. Carlos Santana, GG's. You love to see it, you truly do. But yeah, we're gonna play this conquest for stream today. Tomorrow we will return to the event. We're at eight wins. We need twenty-five for Jason. Ball slam Tana. Yeah, every every home run of his should be a, a grand slam because of his name. No matter how many uh, base runners there are. Got nothing for beating the Cardinals. Aw. Let's go, Jake. If I'm kinda misses significant time, J Ram is getting into the All-Star game. Well, let's hope. Just for the sake of it, that players are healthy as quickly as possible. We all know how the All-Star game kind of is in terms of voting. Some people who deserve the vote, of course, are in, but others uh, who also deserve to be in there are not, which is unfortunate. Yo, what's up, Sunday? You got him in three days. He was 380 by now. Uh, you could have sold Vida. That is true. Diamond Sand for beating the Red Sox. Ooh. That's what uh, Figgy was saying. Tyler. I do not have Grady Sizemore. I went with Eckersley, and I have not gotten uh, the two other bosses yet. I don't know if I will. I would like to at some point, though. Grady's goaded. Grady at parallel four, you love him. Nice. No mercy for the comms. Beating them 10 0, top of the third. Stadium back! Do pitchers lose stamina in Conquest um, throughout the game? Yes, but they'll go back to their original stamina uh, for every single game. Unlike ranked seasons where you kind of have to wait four or five games for them to get 100% of their energy back. Conquest, they get it back every single game. Walk off Grand Slam feels so good. Your opponent did it to you yesterday. The loss feels bad, but you bet he was hyped and that's all about. Oh, 100%. All right, come on, Byron. You got the wheels to get there. You have all the bosses, keep them for the big collection, sell them when they go up. Smart! Garcia deserves to be an all-star. I agree. I agree. Hoping to profit 20k subs by Grady, then get the 50k XP. Yes. As a Cubs fan, it hurts watching the past couple of weeks with all the injuries. I totally feel. I say every single day, I really wish there was a, a real-life button where you can just turn off injuries for everyone. Oh. 
Uh, Jay Fraser, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. I did predict the Brewers comeback, and I did see it. I did see it. You lost all hope for your Cubs for this season for the past six games. You're a Cubs fan, she said? I don't. I didn't think I knew that. I did not think I knew that. Or maybe I did, and I just forgot. Come on, David. Ball one, no strikes. What's up, Sunday? Not bad of a swing. Underneath that, though. What happened to Giannis? He hyperextended his knee. However, uh, based on MRI injury, there is no structural structural damage and um, um, uh, no uh, torn ligaments. So his ligaments are fine. There's no structural damage. There is a possibility he returns during the playoffs. I personally don't think he'll return during the Hawks series, but if the Bucks can make it to the finals, we might see Giannis back in the game. Rough inning for the Sox. I hope Moncada's hand is okay. Same. Dude Food was talking about it. I hope all is well in the end. In injuries make things interesting, though. It's sad when it happens. Oh, 100%. In my mind, I personally rather face a team at 100% health against me at 100% health instead of like through the injuries although of course that is part of sports it is a given was in discord earlier today about the guy who was trying to be toxic and let him pause the timer out yeah yeah, yeah. i think i re reacted to your like ggs with like a gg of my own so good for you for getting that dub real quick i think you said like it was the fastest you've ever pressed the square button get those dubs although that is annoying hawks in seven i don't know i think bucks are gonna win it how many subs do i have i just spent stubs on acuna so i think i'm at like 60 ish k now uh, Ronnie Mauricio card is low-key kind of nice. I don't think I have his card yet. I'm kind of behind on TA2s. Time for Middleton to step up. Oh, I expect some pretty big games today from both him and Drew. And I know they're both capable of it. But also, Middleton has stepped up. And that we would not even be in the Hawks uh, series if not for how clutch Middleton was at the end of the Nets series. So I want to give him respect for that, but also realize... He might have to do a little bit more than what he's typically used to, but I know he's capable of doing that. Having Drew is huge for the Bucks, absolutely. Just for his defense, and of course the offense that comes with it, but his defense is very, very nice. Very, very nice. Uh, knocking CP3, I thought it was just a, a very, un, it was an unsportsmanlike move and pretty uh, classless. Do you think you can get size more from here now? Yeah, you can get size more. You can get him on the marketplace. You won't be able to get him through the program anymore since we're now on the fourth inning program, but you can definitely get size more through the marketplace. He will be available there. You're so new to Diamond Dynasty, so you don't know what to do, but you have one collection complete. We got you free. If you have any questions, we got you. There's fantastic like YouTube videos all over the place. Trust me, Diamond Dynasty is overwhelming. I was very overwhelmed when I dove into it for the first time last year. But eventually, everything kind of clicks together, and you'll get your footing beneath you. Aiden with the one bit. Thank you, thank you, thank you. As a Pelicans fan, y'all scammed us hard for Drew. We could have gotten so much more. We take it. You got Shipper to Tier 4. Let's go. Can you parallel people in Conquest? Yes! You can parallel people in every single game mode besides Moments and Showdown. Very childish event. Classless move. Disgraceful. What's up, Snrub? Do you think I can get Sizemore for you, please? I cannot. There's no way to transfer cards. And if I got Sizemore, I would high-key collect him for myself to get that experience. Yo, twins with the 10 bits. Let's go indeed. Thank you, thank you, thank you, SMH Savannah. I need an SMH emote just for you. Check out Seabright for the DD help. Absolutely. Seabright is great for the DD help. But please be careful of the uh, promos in other people's streams. I'm cool with that for today since I brought up the topic. But be careful about promoing others in other people's streams. Just out of respect. Unless, of course, they ask like I did. All right, another dub in the books. Let's keep it going. In a baseball game that starts an hour and a half, best of luck to you, uh, Doomage. Best of luck. Or don't dodge, excuse me. Excuse me. Just a pug move. Should have been a man and do it face to face instead of when his back was turned. Oh, for sure. In my opinion, he shouldn't have done it at all. You know, it was what it was at that point in the game. But absolutely like a poor move. Twins took the lead. I saw they're up 3 2. But the White Sox have the series one. You have four years of Diamond Dynasty. Did I see your Trout Saga? I don't think so. 
What was your trout saga? The sky. Strong. All right, we have five more strongholds. Oof. I love conquest, but I feel like we've already played a million games. We've only played like three. You packed trout last night, sold him for packs, and then you got him again. That is a fantastic saga. Good for you. Good for you, Post. Yaz with the wheels. Did you get a triple or something? I love Yasmani and the wheels. Is a decent catcher, Kirkuselli. And now you took 170,000 to packs. Got Tatis Jr. Double down on the packs. So got two Acunas. I am. I am so happy for you, Post. I'm thriving for you. Yaz in his one speed, but he can turn on the wheels, though. They need to upgrade the Yaz speed. Oh, for sure. It's pretty disrespectful at one. Yaz can run when he when he needs to. You know? Like like us all. We could run if we needed to, but like we don't want to. What the tournament eligible squad saw means. I saw that with like a Ray Cheesy uh, tweet this morning. And that's a good, it's a good question. I truly don't know what it means at the moment. I wonder if they're if they're getting ready to host some tournaments soon, which is really exciting. So you went from 25k to 700k and confused as to the blessing. We take it though. We take it. Pass the trout the trout pack luck over to you. Yes, we gotta spread it around. The 18 wheeler. What's up, big black? How you doing today? The Vanguard event cards are dope. Love to hear it. Only time you run now is to chase after the ice cream truck. There have not been any truer words than those. You just packed Arenado, your hype. GG's. Let me actually go check the marketplace real quick. So we did get Acuna. We're at 60,000 stubs. So for bets, bets is currently at 38. Tatis is at 90. And they're slowly going back up. It's slowly going back up. We're going to save for Tatis because he's the most expensive. And uh, we might have both of them by the time we finish our pack opening on Saturday. So that's really exciting. Carter with the host. Thank you so much, Carter. How are we doing today? Thank you, thank you, thank you. I have Tatis and Mookie. So I have two diamonds left. What's up, Sims? Because Tatis is more expensive than Mookie, I'm going to save for him first. It's going well, Hamburger Dad. How are you? See you later, Sunday. How close are we to Mo? Do we already have him? I'm 10 out of 15 for vouchers. And I'm closing in on like two or three more vouchers. Mo is kind of on the back burner. Like when I get cards to collect him, I get cards to collect him. But I can definitely shift my focus from the live series to him once we get Chipper. Uh, Little Country Junior, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. You're good. Looking forward to the fourth? Absolutely. You're 10 out of 15 for Mo. Walk off camera, turn the foul pole homer with Adam Dunn. Yes, you bought Justice for 105k. You got Gary Ortiz, Jackie Story, Chipper, your creative player, Trout, and Justice. Oh my god, that is an incredible line of Vicus. Yo, what's up, Emrys? I will say I was a little underwhelmed when they announced them. And then I saw the stats and I was like, okay. I thought Wander was going to be the guaranteed choice for me, but I'm kind of between him and uh, Murray now. I'll probably end up getting Franco, to be honest. But uh, that Eddie card is definitely tempting. What about you, Emers? What are your thoughts on them? 15-0 Red Sox? Wow, has their offense come to life. Doing all three, probably. Let's head toward... Should we do the Twins now? Then we could kind of weave around. I'm trying to think of my best plan of action. I think we'll go over the. I think we'll do the Rangers first. Go to the Rangers first. Murray looks nasty. You're still choosing Franco because his position versatility is crazy useful. I agree 100. percent Plus, you uh, you know you like Wander Swing. That's true as well. You'll get Murray. You'll buy Matthewson at the end of the inning. You'll buy Franco. Perfect. Given your wallet, I know someone's like, "What's the fastest way to make stubs?" And we're like, "Well, to be honest, getting that credit card out." You're gonna pick Wander. Christie has a long windup, so he's no way being your choice though. I was just talking. The only pitcher who I like with a long windup is actually Lefty Grove. I do like him. You got an Ultra? GG's. You got signed Griffey gloves. That is incredible. You hate Wonder Swing? It's. I'm like back and forth with it. I really want to give that 99 a chance, though. Have the hidden rewards been good in this conquest? Let's see. We've gotten a couple packs, a couple headliners. I believe there's a there's a diamond stadium. We just haven't gotten it yet. I, I want to say it's behind the Texas stronghold. You got Poppy today, so you're going with Wander to replace T. Smart. What's up, Camster? I correct, correct. I do not have a cap. I mean, I have it made, but I 
don't use him. Your dad gave you an 8.5 graded tops Ichiro rookie card today. Yo, that's amazing. Five pack bundle. Ooh, I don't know if we got the five pack bundle yet. Is that the one that's behind the Rangers stronghold? Do I know Buster Posey's real name is Gerald? Yes. If I would have had to state that from memory, no, but I, I do recall that. Do I use OBS or stream lives? I use OBS live, so stream elements. How much experience am I at? I have no idea. I've been just I've just been doing the conquest, so I will check once we finish this map. Any good hidden rewards for the most part? I think it's pretty decent. There we go, Simeon. Nice way to start this off. Not what you wanted, but you'll take it. You finally figured out the logo stuff as well. Nice. Ball one, no strike. Sure, Hamburger Dad. I don't know his middle name. Where are they? Basically, every stronghold has had something, if I recall correctly. I don't recall if I've gotten much outside of the strongholds. I'm sure I have. I just haven't tabbed it down. That's ball three. Not the Cardinals? Okay. I've not taken over their stronghold yet. Nice, Trout. Let's go. Let's go, Trout. Back to back. Perfect, perfect home runs to start the last two games for Trout. We love to see it. Oh, for sure. I just don't have the time to grind one right now. I know in the end it's worth it. Maybe we'll mess with it a little later. Any diamond packs? Not that I recall. I think there's, you're going to get a diamond stadium, though, in this conquest. Jim Tomey's just lining out all over the place. Socks have lined out like 10 times. Well, then it makes sense. Jim Tomey just lined out right there. Let's go, Jake. Does this map have a lot of uh, fan stealing involved? Well, Savannah, it has exactly zero fan stealing involved. That's why it's my favorite map right now. <laughs> Thank you, Greg. Our caps end game, they might just be. What sports do I play? I was a runner growing up and then I was a badminton player in high school. I don't play any organized sports in college, but I would love to join an adult softball league. But I'm always involved in intramurals. Perfect, perfect lineouts are annoying. Oh, 100%. Oh, well. Get rid of caps. Wait, no fan stealing? Correct. Oh. No fan stealing. It is the best. Does Father's Day Conquest give XP? No. The Mother's Day and Father's Day did not give any XP. He's Might not. touch Conquest this time? Yes. That's one of the big things why I don't want to do that USA Conquest map. I don't want to steal the fans. Because you have to steal like a million of them. And I'm just not interested. Hey. All ones that count. Dang it. Trying to figure out the marketplace. Why are all the cards going down so quickly today? It's because packs are half off. It's because packs are half off for the next couple of days. Until the 6th, I believe. 4-4 hey. four, four now. White Sox tied it. Let's go. Is that a perfect no doubt robbery? Dang. When I hit a home with Trout, you had you had hit one with Baez. Let's go. Perfect timing. Wow. Am I crazy? Get five to ten thousand of him. Oh my. Might as well. I've got nothing to lose. Nope. Outside. 50 million fans, but you get a lot of prospect packs. Cards, excuse me. Worth it just for that. Took a shock. You did the US map twice. What's up, Flyers? I'm doing well, Crap TV. How are you doing today? Right now is probably the best time to buy up, but prices will be permanently lower, so no fret. True, 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 true. Hey. Ball, well, that's out. Outside, that's a ball. Once I get Shipper, I'm gonna have some lineup choices because Vlad Guerrero's raking for me. So we'll see. 
Sounds good, Harrison. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, the home run derby jock. He's gonna be great for the moonshot event on the 9th. The USA map may be worth the grind because you get a ton of experience. Plus, you get the five prospect cards per pack instead of just one. Yeah, you can get all the prospect packs now. All the prospect cards now from just one time through the map, which is a big dub. But an extra 30 Peralta since he's 3.3k right now. There you go. Am I saving for the St. Louis for last? I've already finished the St. Louis collection. All I need is Tatis and Mookie Betts. And I have enough for Mookie. I'm like 30k short of Tatis. And you'll need the prospects for the big collection. Absolutely. I'll eventually get them. Red Sox are winning 15 nothing. Holy. So glad Mancini's doing the derby. Same. Still waiting for them to fill up that roster. I'm excited who else is going to join. I hope Joey Gallo joins. I would love that. What a swing. Oh, and two. Yep, Tati's in 90k right now. I'm at, I'm at 60k stubs after I just bought Acuna. Come on, Carlos. You want Gallo to join? Sat down, sold all pieces. Actually, around 820k. You had like seven Aloys and eight Jose Abreus. Dang, make that bank. I know, with the kitchen sink packs in this program, uh, I'll have a shot at uh, Baines, Dunn, and Jimenez for the White Sox team. Yep, they changed it, Vicus. So every time you finish a division, you get all five of those cards that are in the pack. Correct. You want to make a Sand Squad team of all Tri Sox pe peeps? Me too! I already have it um, up and going. I, just, I really need, like... Uh, uh, pitchers for it at the moment but me too my favorite food pizza for dinner tonight jock and vladdy uh, rematch would be amazing that would be amazing if jock peterson will uh, come back did acuna join the derby he did not you never used to should have done the map now yeah vladdy won't be doing the derby this year that is true he has already said uh he I won't Schwarber for the Derby. Yes, get Schwarber in the Derby. I would very much enjoy that. What's my least favorite food? That's a good question. Um, I don't know. I mean, I think hamburgers are pretty gross. Not gonna lie. I'm not, I just, I'm, I've never been a fan of ground beef. But is, is it my least favorite food? Weirdo, how dare you? Oh, <laughs> Says hamburger dad. I knew I was gonna get judgment to answer if I answered that question, but I knew I had to. I got the count. Oh, snub. I mean broccoli. That's my least favorite food. Who doesn't like broccoli? Ooh, appeases the majority. Copex in. Let's go. No, I am sad. Unsubscribe. And now hamburgers. I've never been a ground beef person. Ground beef, it just it's never sat well with me. It's I wonder if it's like a texture thing, to be honest. But uh so many times my family cooked up hamburgers, I would try it every single time, and every single time without fail, I was like, this is nasty. Tree boy sad. I told y'all. Does condiments count as food? Um when I think of food, I think of like actual meals, but you can definitely dislike condiments. Boiled broccoli is the best. I like uh, broccoli out of the oven. I want to make experience quick. Uh, playing the game. Y'all wouldn't listen to me. Impossible burgers are pretty awesome. I've never had them. But I know they have like a similar taste to real burgers. So I feel like I would even still dislike impossible burgers. You're definitely eating before I go to an Ashley fan meetup. Don't worry. We'll have all the good food. We'll have curly fries. We'll have chicken tendies. We'll have a big fruit salad. We'll have good stuff. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. Is it worth doing the conquest map? Yes. For the experience. And for the good vibes. And for people to judge you on your food takes. I'm joking. I think bullying people for their food preference is not very beast. My IRL friends bully you for not liking Indian food. They asked me if I'm going to order the chicken nuggets at the kid menus, and I have to answer with yes, because I am. Right, Snub? I feel that. I feel that. We all have our very own weird food interests, but I'm still gonna be judged. Oh, I bully people for their food taste. I'm not ashamed of it. 
<laughs> I walk into chicken tendies. What? How's it going? It's going well, DM Neos. How are you? If you don't really like the taste of burgers, check out Beyond Meat. It's what my vegan friends like because they are distant enough. Absolutely. Yeah, I do not like the taste at all. Because of the food. Smoke a brisket this weekend. You feel like your mean would be low-key nasty in the derby? Yes. I would love to see your mean uh, Mercedes at the derby. One oh. Broccoli is nasty like it's cousin cauliflower. Yeah, cauliflower is not very good. Do I eat tacos? I, I eat chicken tacos. I eat chicken tacos. Do not eat ground beef tacos. I have chicken tacos. And they are delicious. Tree boy, sad, sad. I'm sorry, tree boy. Eat your veggies, people. I, my, probably my favorite vegetable is uh, green beans. I love green beans. Green beans are goaded. Y'all, do y'all know TGI Fridays? Do any of you have TGI Fridays near you? They have like breaded green beans, so it makes a healthy thing not healthy, but it's delicious. And it's an appetizer and it's very, very good. Cauliflower is a whack. Curse Mikey with the one bit. Thank you so much. Brisket tacos. Broccoli is one of the most deadly foods. If you don't eat your veggies, you'll be as bad as Tyler Chatwood's ERA. No disrespect, disrespect to the tree veggies. We'll be keeping yourself busy with LMB this weekend. I'll mark her six years since your mom passed away on Sunday. I'm so sorry to hear that, Ooplies. Let me know if you need anything, of course. Going well, 10 points away from the 1,000 for the first time this year in ring. Look at DM Neos go. Taking a little break, didn't warm up before that game. GG's uh, DM Neos. All the hype for you. Want to try those green beans? Happen has something similar. They are so good. Of course. Fried green beans and regular green beans do smack though, right? I'm afraid to ask Ashley for a kitchen tour. Oh, our kitchen is good. We just got a air fryer. And my sister and I have been using it like crazy these last couple days. Need to try roasted cauliflower, olive oil, grated cheese, and breadcrumbs. Bacon in the oven. That does kind of sound good. That does. Simpsons reference broccoli took out Homer. Dang it. I love a lot of pasta oh, dishes too. Down. I'm a big spaghetti person. Like, one of my favorite comfort meals is uh, spaghetti and garlic bread. You can't go wrong with spaghetti and garlic bread. Legend isn't as bad as you thought. It takes a ton more patience, but you'll lower your strikeout rate soon. Your team's too good for Conquest. You're playing, you're playing out of All-Star and went through the whole nine without an out in the first. Play on Legend. That's why I play in Hall of Fame. I probably should play on Legend, but I just play in Hall of Fame for Conquest. An air fryer is super useful. You'll love it. Yes. Yes, Snrub is a big Simpsons fan. Angel hair pasta is God mode to you. Favorite type of pizza, yours is cheese and a pepperoni. Carbonara spaghetti is clutch. You melted your air fryer? Oh no. We got 99 speed. Should we send him home? Yeah. And 99 speed, you're definitely going home. And you're safe. Try to race someone driving a giant ravioli once, but I couldn't get pasta. You just made spaghetti and garlic bread last night. I am jealous. Nope. Outside. Air fryer is greater than the microwave. Oh, 100 percent The new wave oven does it all. Ooh. Oh, you're rolling your eyes at Valencia. Oh, the joke, the joke. It wasn't mine for once. Tonight will be tacos. What are we having tonight for dinner? I don't think I know. And melting the air fryer. Fried avocado in the air fryer. In the air fryer is fryer. That's then dip it in chipotle sauce. Did you put your air fryer in the air fryer here in Brazil? We cook garlic bread in the grill due to your barbecue parties. Ooh, that sounds good. Hello, oh, dude. What's up, y'all? You're back? What's up, pump? And you're the only one that has to know what's for dinner, like, right in the morning. I usually do, but I don't know if you had any plans today. I think today's gonna be, like, fun for yourself. Make homemade burgers. No, we actually don't make burgers a lot. We just had chicken kebabs on the grill. What, last weekend? Those are really good. Do I have a PC or a laptop? I have a laptop for school and a PC for this. Red rocks, anyone? You seen enough gore with the instant pots when someone uh, set them on the hot stove burner. Oh no. Thanks for explaining the word many to me. It means a lot. I've seen that before and I cracked up. Have I had fajita, uh, fajita, uh, uh, fajitas? Yes. Couldn't pronounce that for a hot second. 
They're like my go-to at Chili's. If I go to Chili's, you get the chicken fajitas. So good. Let's go, IB. Ooh, Buxton's got the speed. He covers it. Weather's horrible, you hear? It's been pretty bad the last couple of days, but I see the sun now, so I like when I can see the sun. Dang, it's already 3.20? We had a lot of progress. I don't know if we'll finish this map today. We gotta get hustling and bustling. Oh, on the stove and the heat melted it. With the slogan of Red Rocks? Pretty sure it's pronounced fajitas. I I know, JSEC. It took me a second in my brain. My brain was computing. I'm like, ah, fajitas. That's that word. Five days in a row where you live in Illinois. Yeah, it rained here like the whole the whole long weekend. I think today's like the first day we haven't gotten rain. What the heck is up with these all these two strike uh hits? Gotta get Ashley out of the Midwest. You were originally saving stubs for story for short too. Now you want Franco not to waste the stubs. And we'll just keep him in right now. Even though we're kind of out of energy. Hey. Actually, no, because this is the tie-in run. We gotta bring in Eckersley. East Coast had bad weather. The past two days is supposed to be bad the next couple of days. Recently took a poll. We found that 100% of people were upset when the tent collapsed. 91 knows 99 is coming. He's starting to struggle. He does. The pressure is on. Guess where we ate the last day at NC? Culver's! You can never escape Culver's. It's just too good. Did you say hi to the, the to the Charlotte Knights for us? Oh, of course, water, absolutely. It's always in the description of every video too. But welcome on in, welcome on in. Never had it? Culver's? Oh my god, Culver's will change your life. It will change your life. <laughs> nope. Those butter burgers, Homer Simpson drool. I just love uh their chicken tenders <laughs> and their concretes. <laughs> Look at all these packs. All right. Um, I guess we'll move on to the angel since we're right here. Back to work. Back to work. Much appreciation to you all, fam. Absolutely, post. We appreciate you. Have a good rest of your time at work. Culver's spicy chicken sandwich. Culver's is a spicy chicken sandwich now. I need to try it. If y'all haven't tried the spicy McChicken at McDonald's, you need to. I am very impressed. I think the spicy McChicken is a tad better than Wendy's spicy nuggets. And then I just had Portillo's. Portillo's came out with a spicy chicken sandwich and it had nothing on McDonald's, nothing. Chicken tenders are so good for sure. But grilled onions on burgers at Culver's, had them for dinner last night. Okay, now I'm out. Oh, grilled onions are good on like anything that is acceptable for grilled onions. Culver's is gas, yes. Hard disagree on the McDee's chicken. The, the, not the, there's like two spicy chickens. The spicy McChicken. And then there's like a second spicy sandwich. I heard that one is terrible. I have heard that is terrible. But the McChicken. Um, chicken, I guess I should say. Collins? What do Collins do? <gasps> Solo Homer, Sox lead 5-4 in the 6. Good for Collins. Let's go, Joe. Let's go, dude food. Spicy chicken sandwich from Popeyes is fire. I have yet to try it from Popeyes. So I definitely need to make that happen. Ooh, should I take over the twins first, then go to the angels? And eh, I'm right here. Might as well just take them over. What's the best chicken sandwich in my opinion? I have not tried all of them. So I'll have to wait till I at least try Popeye's first. I've had Popeye's chicken tenders, of course. I've not had their sandwich, actually. I like Luminaldi Luminaldi's over than Giordano's. I'm the opposite. I, I do not care for Luminaldi's. Probably because I'm not a thin crust pizza person. I like hand tossed dough better. Nothing compares to the Popeye's chicken sandwich. I need to try it. I need to try it. Home run socks with Colin. Story has the best swing. I've heard that. Boo, you can put it on the board. When you live in Wisconsin here, Culver's. Yes, or in Illinois. It's a perfect staple, Owen. Zach Collins, BR legend last year. Not for me, though. It's quite disappointing. Baseball will come out tomorrow. We'll hit the line outs and the fly balls till the three outs. Thoughts? Popeye's uh, spicy chicken is good. I need to try it. I need to try it. Do we have frishes in Chicago? I don't think so. At least not uh, where I am. Love the chicken Popeyes.
The new BK one is almost as good as Popeyes. Almost. Ooh. I've only been to Burger King like twice in my life. Oh my god, Oppo hit for Simeon. He's on fire. All right, let's go. We should have time for at least one more game after this one. Get through. The BK chicken sandwich slaps as well. All right, I might have to make a stop at Burger King. If anyone is making a Culver's one, I'll take a large order of cheese curds, please. You and my sister both. She's obsessed with her cheese curds. Wendy's is green than Burger King. You were a huge Burger King fan. Their prices got too expensive. I love Wendy's. Someone just made me watch the home run replay in BR. Then he walked it off. Let's go, KR. Lightning Simi is by far the best player right now. Let's go. Do I think they should have lost their World Series trophy? Um, if they lose their World Series trophy, there's going to be many other teams that lose uh, different rewards and stuff like that. I definitely agree they didn't get, to get like any of a punishment. But I don't know, the MLB is kind of in a mess right now, especially with the substances. Chick-fil-A is the best chicken sandwiches. I don't go to Chick-fil-A. I don't support them. A and W cheese curds are the bomb. I've never been to A and W. They're the same one. They're aren't they a root beer brand? I don't drink soda, so I don't know. As a Wisconsinite, being obsessed with cheese curds is in our blood. You never had a cheese curd. You never had a bad cheese curd. Not a fan of them at all. Done with the conquest for days. Driving you crazy. Oh no. I don't want that to happen. No, it stays in the infield. 99 speed. Everyone's safe. Let's go. Bad PCI though. What's a cheese curd? You're kidding, right? It's fried cheese in a little, in like a little ball shape. Ball one, no You're from the one. South, so while you enjoy CFA's food, you got to give them up. Haven't had fast food in nine months. That is a very awesome uh, streak you have going on. No, legit. You've never seen one. I'm, I'm kind of shocked right now, Hamburger Dad. Interesting. I highly recommend if you ever have a chance to uh, try one. You got caught up in order the show on the White Sox. Let's go. Billy stole third on the first pitch. What an icon, Billy Hamilton. Haven't had fast food in nine minutes. Me. I feel that. I feel that. Wow, the first time we don't score a run in the first inning. Oh. Culver's has great onion rings. It's underrated. It's underrated. Just bought two 20 packs. He was in them. What in the hack? Post, can you like start buying my packs from me? Just ship them over. All right, this is the one time we did not get off get off to a quick start. So need to be careful pitching wise. Can't be can't be lazy here. Were there good cheese curds in California? Ooh, California doesn't have doesn't California have like a little bit of everything depending like where you are, where you go? I don't know. I'm sure there's gotta be like a Midwest based restaurant there. Since McDonald's 10 minutes ago, you work at Culver's? G to the G. I, like, uh, half of my high school friends worked at our local Culver's. You love Culver's cheese curds, especially when on sale? I, like, every time uh, my Nana comes over, like, usually, like, once a month with the buy one, get one free with the, with the Culver concrete mixers. And that is the best deal. Totally a Midwest thing. You've only seen Culver's when driving around Michigan. Thought we had pretty much everything LOL. This cheese curd discussion has me thinking otherwise. They're not just in Culver's, but you can definitely find them at Culver's. Dairy Queen has them. Dairy Queen just added them to the menu. I know, because my sister, when we got Dairy Queen a couple weeks ago, she ordered the cheese curds to compare them with Culver's. She does like Culver's better than Dairy Queen's cheese curds. But if you need a try if you need well, cheese curds in a crunch, you can get them from Dairy Queen. Have you ever had poutine? I've actually not had poutine. But they do have cheese curds and poutine. They're just not fried. 5-4 White Sox? Yep. Zach Collins. Fried cheese or fried mozzarella is what you're good here, but it's different. Uh, notice we changed this whole topic to food. Absolutely. Food deserves our respect. We must always talk about it. You've had poutine. Had to get when you were in Canada. Yeah, so poutine. That cheese? That's a cheese curd. Just what Culver sells, when you talk about cheese curds from Culver's, it's just fried. So it's got a breading layer. Indeed. Cheesy poofs. 
Yeah, those cheesy poofs. Um, uh, it's called like pirate booty from Trader Joe's. Those are good. What a play. Got him. Of curdled milk. I think the Mariners will make the playoffs this year. I do not. That sounds pretty good. You weren't listening properly, so I thought this conversation went from food to Russian president. No, 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 no. Just talking about food still. Best is to get courage from Mars Cheese Castle in Kenosha, Wisconsin, and make your own. Um, when my brother and I drove to Green Bay, our mom was like, can you please stop at uh, Mars Cheese Castle? Usually when any any one of our family members goes up to Wisconsin, there is someone somewhere requests them to stop at Mars. One -oh. Poutine, Putin. <laughs> Buffalo Wild Wings cheese curds are so good. I've only been to B-dubs once, just because I'm just not a big wings person. There's our first run. Carlos Santana, everyone. You're done with them be the show for today. When you and your family goes to Culver's, we all get the kids meals, so we get the free ice cream. Oh my God, it is such a deal. I have so many of those like, tokens that i can redeem them for free stuff now i need to go to culver's i need to bring like someone young though with me <laughs> wonder if winker will be voting the asg he's a shot I, I did i vote for him in my ballot i think i did actually i think i did santana let's go six four socks yes what game are we on we are on i think this is past half of the strongholds now once we get this game done what's up bardic Cheesy 2022. Yes, it's a thing. Look it up. I believe it. I believe it. All right, another insurance run would be nice here. Put gravy on him. Apo taco with David. We just missed it. Suns are in the finals. Hopefully the Bucks can join them soon. Yeah, there we go. Barda ground the safe wavelength. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. I need to get like a new chair like really badly. <laughs> um, let's bring in Britain. Yes, uh, oh, it is literally the best case scenario, Bardic. I was so freaking happy. I found out right at the end of stream yesterday and I was off the wall excited. Did you hear the rumor? Did you hear the rumor? It's some guy on Reddit. Apparently, I got I don't want to put too much credit in it, but apparently some guy's friend was working at a bar and PJ Tucker came in to order some wings. And apparently he and the and the bartender were talking and PJ told him that Giannis, uh, Giannis and the doctors, the doctors told Giannis that he can return as early as a possible game seven. Again, I don't want to put too much stock in it, but the fact that they haven't ruled him out indefinitely makes you think but of course i don't want him to risk himself any further i just want him to be healthy at the end of the day 25 minutes away from cheddar birthplace of the cheese your claim to cheese fame what's up best 2k how are we doing since the bulls suck milwaukee is your team that would be great you saw that too cheese head who's winning the series hucks or hawks or bucks i will always have my faith on the bucks i uh, I truly expect the crowd at Pfizer to get to help the Bucks get this dub tonight. I truly expect that. I think the energy is going to be amazing and it's a tied game. Have I played the Cardinals yet? I've not. No structural damage and nothing wrong with the ligaments. Absolutely. I have not done the tops now yet. I have not. We went straight to conquest and it's kind of a long one. There's kind of a lot of strongholds. One ball, What's good, right Jordan? Now. How's it going? That's ball two. Oh, um, X Switch Point Sports, little Tiki God. I'm a big Packers fan. The energy is gonna be nuts. Gonna need all of it to win without Giannis. 100%. Chris got to step up. He will. I believe in him. It's gonna be tough, but I believe in this team. If the Bucks make it, you're getting your Cream City hat. Yes. All right, come on, Simeon. Dang it, we're just missing. Uh, we just missed the change up with our tees. We just missed the slider with Simeon. What boss am I taking? Probably Wander. Conquest is way easy. Yeah, I've not had any issues with it so far. Besides these angels. It's the first time I'm tied in this game. I usually always take the lead right away and just don't give it up. All right, there we go, Trotty. 
Chris has been good when Giannis is at his off days. Hopefully he and Drew go off. Absolutely. They hear the chants about the Hawks and Six? Well, of course. Just like I'm sure they'll hear chants about the Bucks and Six if the Bucks take the dub today. Angels are tough, absolutely. That's the Yankees, they're a pesky team. Ballin' under the Angel stronghold. Let's go, T Hoff. Thank you for letting me know. No, we're gonna have to go to extras. He's out. Tough. He's out. It's time for Giannis to get over that hump. Two MVPs. He needs that ring. He'll get it. He'll get it. It's, you had a tough time being the Red Sox. Gonna be a problem for you as well. Still waiting on your city connect, Milton Jersey. Fanatics dropped the ball. It's been over a month. Oh my god. I have the Giannis statement, a statement jersey with the Jordan logo. I got that from Fanatics and actually came really quickly. I got it a couple months ago because they had like a, they did one of those like 30% off sales. So I got like 30 bucks off the jersey. Uh, Chase, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Not a huge basketball person, but you love the NBA 2K games. Yo, I downloaded the most recent 2K game like a month ago now because it was free on the Epic Game Store. I haven't played it yet, but I need to. But growing up, and I really wish I remembered what the title of the game was. But at my cousin's house, they had a basketball game for their GameCube. And I legit played it with my cousins nonstop over there. And I wish I knew the name of the game. It was literally fantastic. I think eventually they lost it when they like moved houses in our childhood. But it was such a fun game. That's actually how I fell in love with the sport to begin with. Uh, Jordan, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. It was so good. I, I truly don't know. You got games on your cube? I don't know if it was NBA Street or something. I truly don't know. NBA Jam, maybe. I, I truly don't know. NBA Street Volume 2 or 3, maybe. Oh, thank you, Red Sox guy. But it was literally so fun. So, so, so fun. NBA Jam was Genesis. So yeah, probably an NBA Street game. Those statement jerseys are clean if we win. I'm treating myself to a Cream City jersey, as you should. As you should. Uh, Jazz, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. That's a ball. Sons or Bucks will win the finals, and that's final. That's I like the sign of that. Ball, NBA Street Volume 3 is amazing. Anyone can fall in love with it. What were the release dates? I don't know if you all know them off the top of your head. I can always look up. What were the release dates for Volume 2 or 3? Of course, I was 2002. Street had those crazy dunk animations. You played three on three, volume three, and Mario characters. It definitely did not have Mario characters. I think it was the three on three. I, I feel like I remember the three on three formats. And I always played as the Raptors because I was a big dinosaur person. So I played as the Toronto Raptors. Street volume two was 2003. It might be that. Because when did they move their first? So they moved in 06. Six oh five. I want. Oh my God! It might have been Street Volume Two. I'm gonna put this on Google real quick so I can look this up after. Uh, NBA Street Volume Two. It might have been that. I don't remember because they just had like a binder with the CDs. They didn't keep like the cases for their games, so I won't recognize it off of like the picture. But I'll try to look at trailers and stuff. It might have been Street Volume Two. Because we played it in the early 2000s. Dang it. Oh, two is the count. Come on, Byron. Do we contact something with Byron? I think we have to. Can't see the freaking baseball in this sun. Double dribble? You play volume three a ton as a kid? Farther than you in Conquest. GG's. I haven't lost a game yet, but obviously an extra inning game is not going to help timing wise. One and two. Priester and Gwyn are parallel to GG's. Bring back the arch rivals. I cannot see the baseball. What's up, Easy? How are you doing today? Playing the Angels right now. Double dribble so awesome back in the day. <clears> throat's getting dry. Joey Gallo is two for two. Good for Joey. I cannot pick up the baseball. Ball, that's just out. Jordan versus Bird. Are y'all gonna watch the new Space Jam that comes out in a couple of weeks now? We have a HBO Max subscription. I don't know how we got it. It was something with our Xfinity deal. So I will be watching it when it comes out. What's up, Remy the Rats? You're not? You're good? I'm doing well. Win it for the ball in. I heard there's a ball in. We definitely have to win it for the ball in. We need Dante to come through with a base hit here. You're not going to? You are? No, it looks meh. I feel like I have to see it. 
Because I was a big fan of like the OG Space Jam. One, one, no strikes. Definitely remember Jordan versus Bird. I, I, my, one of my friends, I think it was Amanda, sent me a link to like the trailer to the Big Red Dog Clifford. Whoa, and I was, I was kind of shook. I don't know if I'll see it though. That's what I'm saying, JSEC. I want to rewatch the Jordan one first. Ball, that's out. Any good rewards? We got a lot of good packs so far. A lot of headliners, a lot of standards. Apparently, we're going to get a ball in once we win this game. There's, rumor has it, there's a Diamond Stadium pack. Oh, 100% agree, Swampy. 100% agree. I need to get this dub here. Come on, Dante. 3 1 count. Dang it! We're gonna have to go to freaking the fifth inning. Oh. Clifford needs the Sonic treatment! Yeah, make it go back into production for a little bit more. Disappointed with the trailer? I haven't seen the trailer yet. If it comes on TV, you might watch it but not say without MJ in it. Uncanny Valley. You are for sure. Nice notes on HBO Max. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That it is. Please don't lose this game. I'm gonna lose this game. Pain! I hate losing conquest games. We're playing Hall of Fame stories of 1,000 average in conquest. Let's go. I'm also playing on Hall of Fame. And the Angels stumps me. That is pain. You're right, Swampy! You blame Space Jam for laws. There's Simeon. There's the parallel three. Oh, I hate losing in Conquest. It just takes the like the momentum and energy out of you. Uh, Team JJ and Jazz, thank you for the follows. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Big pain. Let's go check the marketplace. I kind of don't even I wanna I'll just pick up Conquest tomorrow, I think. We got it, we got less than 20 minutes left to stream. Let's look at collections. <laughs> All right, Tatis is actually slowly going back up in price. Mookie Solo. Big Red Racing. Days spent playing that game. I feel like I've heard of that game. Cards have tanked, yes. You have new Simeon ones? You got to. He's cracked. Well, how's it? What was in very and very uh. What's the word we're looking for? And not as many online point appearance, so only 22 at bats, but he's hitting almost 600 online for me. This is the online stats. Vladdy's pretty good, but also only 50 at bats, so take it as you will. Like you do in real life? All right, do we play one more conquest game? I'm like, that just took the energy from me. Let's go, go take it back. We're gonna do ball player collection. Remind me after this game. Check the trailer, the big red dog trailer. Clifford, the big red dog. On the Diamond Dynasty team. Oh, yeah, yeah. I have an extra tab pulled up. I have a tab pulled up to remind me after stream. Simeon's just an amazing swing for you. Rig with Buxton, Lightning, and Simeon's better to me. Yeah, I'm better with Simeon than Buxton, but both are pretty good right now. Dang it, did we really just miss that too? We really did. Tough. What happened to the D-backs? What happened to the D-backs? They, they just set the record for like the longest losing streak. Play our games on rookie? No judgment. I just still want Hall of Fame to have some semblance of fast timing, even though not really. They were in contention just last year. They were not. Oh, At least I don't think so. Come on, we need some PCI luck on this one. Yep, look, Lastro got traded. Switch Bucks and Alfred Dominguez. Ooh, that'll be a nice switch, especially with the switch hitting that Jason has. I did! Exclamation point MNT for Michael Nelson Trout. They came out with the Sweet City Connect swag, so I thought they were making a run. Yeah, that was de that was decided before the season started. The City Connect. How much was Nolan before the pack downgrade? I don't know. It's right above you, Remy. Angel had it in there for chat for you. Ah. 
Low 40s. 50k. Very baller. Very, very baller. Couldn't make any Yankees any better, though. Try the snow card. Going really well, Chief Pat. Going very, very well. We've just been working on the Conquest, so not too much. But the Conquest has been going well overall. I think you have three. I lost to the Angels, so... I think three or four after the Angels. I think three. So I'll probably finish it off tomorrow. No, we're gonna play the event on stream tomorrow. So I'll, I'll probably finish this Conquest off stream. Um, Hawk, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. How we doing? How the store's gonna blow out the White Sox and get swept by the Orioles. Baseball is so weird. It's my favorite Hawk Harrelson phrase. Uh, it doesn't matter. It does not matter who you face. It matters when you face them. When teams are hot and when teams are not. No matter who they are. Just made a Matrix reference. What year is it? I love it. Yep, that ball went out. Stream is going very well, Mr. Basic Chick. I hope you're doing well as well. At the wrong time, absolutely. He has a bad two weeks, get downgraded to 85 to 89. Then he has a good two weeks, get upgraded to a 90 plus and goes back to, back and forth. Vlad E sneaks it through the shift. Hitting six bombs in the first inning. There we go, Mariners Nation. Let's go easy. Let's get this dub here. And stream with a dub. Ball, if the Rangers win, we'll win the series in Oakland. Ooh, there we go. Think we might have missed it. Yeah. We were just missing many of these pitches. When is 50% off packs and chat was saying on the six. Uh Mandrel, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Though it was entertaining, it was an embarrassment. Yo, what's up, King? Hope all is well today. We're just missing so many of these. Oh my goodness. We are hot. We are off to such a hot start, too. It's all good. No worries. Acuna Moncada. What a wonderful phrase. Ball. One ball, one strike. Ball, that's off the plate. Hey. Two two the count. You just pulled Kershaw GG's. GG's. Are you close to finishing live series collections if you haven't already? We're two cards away. We're Mookie and Tatis away. I'm so excited. I did, easy. I didn't see it, but I heard about it. Didn't see it, but I heard about it. Just one of those bad losses, but they're gonna happen. It's a long season. No balls, two strikes. Nice catch. Couldn't get their ninth hitter out. Mm-hmm. It was pain. It was just a painful series for Sox fans. All right, let's go take the lead and then get the save. He's out. And then check our progress, of course. We got Jordan Groshans, who's heating it up lately. Albie's almost a lock to a diamond. He now has seven RBI since last night. Good for him. I have a couple extra Albies, which I'm very excited about. Story's not missing. 10 ABs, 10 hits, three homers. Keep it up. How do you feel about golds and below becoming FA in collections, but IL diamonds like Trout remain in their team's lineup still? It's interesting. I feel like it'd be nice to have a little more consistency. Like, if the golds are going to go, then you probably should have the diamonds. But I don't know. Trout will never go to, like, the FA list on the injured list just because, like, how important he is to collections. But yet, so then if he doesn't, I don't think the others should as well. It it's interesting. I really don't know. And the ball player set, we can do that. Wow. Great hit, but it was an out. 
Yeah, exactly unhittable. Exactly. If there's like a bench option. I think it's just tricky because the collections are based off of the 40-man roster, which obviously the IL affects. Where's that first base? Or a sleeping giant, they're finding ways. Come on, Trouty. If they got a trap from collections, it would be a Mickey Mouse collection. Yeah, exactly. That's why they got to keep him in. But if you keep Trout in, you should probably keep like the rest of players in. Oh, for sure, Angel. Grand slam, nonetheless, to tie the game. Andrew Vaughn broke Chapman, and honestly, I'm here for it. Yep. Otani got the no decision, which is awesome. They're on the 10-day IL. They're still on the 40-man, though, right? Yeah, but I think Trout got transferred to the 60-day at one point. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. I don't know if that changes the roster. But yeah, you're right. But it's weird because some golds, some golds who are just on the 10-day IL, they'll go to, like, the free agents instead of the collections. It, it's weird. Mookie got 44. Oh, you got this, Hoosiers. You got this. Just Paralified Chipper. That's what we're here for, T-Rad. As a 60 RA. It's all good. That would be amazing, Harrison. You would profit like crazy. Oh, in the All-Star game? I agree, Angel. I agree. Come on, go, Mike Trout. Mike Trout flies out to Mike Trout. We're going to have to go to extra innings twice against the Angels. And we all know how he did against them last time. I guess the Angels are my nemesis when it comes to Conquest. Ooh, nice, King. Enjoy the little storage expansion. That's going to be exciting. Get some more oh, games, of course. Twins and Angels? Yes. Knew about the Angels. Glad to know about the Twins now. I got to count one and two. Checking the price of Garrett Cole. Please remind me. Please, please, please remind me. Do I have a screen cap of my team uniforms on my Insta or Twitter? I do not. I do not. Not a weird question at all. These are yours. You always lose the first time against them. That's like the Angels this year. It used to be the Dodgers last year. Now it's the Angels, the other LA team. Cole is 119. Thank you so much, Davis. Did you hear? Did you see that, Harrison? I did buy Acuna, Angel. I did. I did. Got him for 160 instead of like 220. So now we just need Mookie and Tatis. So we're saving for Tatis because he's slightly more expensive than Mookie by like 30k. Aye. Oh, for sure, Harrison. I'm sure that helps. You're on the Cubs stronghold? Nice. To extras we go! Let's get this dub. Trout starts at second base. Really? How to swing at that pitch? Come on, let's drive one here for Trout. We're just missing fire. Tatis is very, very fire. Agreed. I did drip and it is quite disgusting. It is quite disturbing and I have no idea why he still has a job. It is it is horrendous and that is an understatement. There we go. Needed that. Little RBI double for Jim Tomey. Let's keep it up. We're going to need a few more insurance runs probably. Hey, facing this wind up. They have not hamburger, but I also don't think they've uh I also don't think they've removed Ozuna yet. Search stop locked down for you since then. Buxton has 131 hits, 53 of them homers. Guy is ridiculous. Absolutely. Rigging against Maeda. Yep. Or Chapman. Let's go, Jake. They do. They do have the extra innings rule. Who are the henchmen? Ooh, I don't recall off the top of my head. Come on, Vladdy. Just late. Got Billy and Judge. Let's go. Let's go. 
Yeah, he was toxic from the start drip. There, I always got a really bad vibe from him. And, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Fingers, Smoltz, and Perez. Thank you for that, Angel. I will definitely be taking Raleigh Fingers. Not Jock. Uh, Fingers, Fingers. Jock is like the flashback pack thing. All right, let's go win ourselves a ball game. 20 games into the season. No, he knew, he knew. All right, Dennis, let's do this. Got him. Player stats in versus CP are only DD. Yeah, you will you can switch. You can switch between player stats. You can switch from online versus CPU. See how you do in against online players and see how you do against the CPU. It'll give you the option. I think it's R1 and R2. Or uh, R1 and L1 to switch between. Or it's uh, R2 and L2. Nice. That was a clutch strikeout. Is that Goose pitching? Eckersley. Eckersley is pitching. Outside. And of course we gotta get this final out against Trout. Ball, that pitch is out. Oh my god, we did it. Let's go. Just gotta make the catch now. Two trouts. G to the G's. Yo, Mr. Pizza Chick with the 100 bids. You're absolutely welcome. Thank you for the bids. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate that. Let's see where we are in Conquest. We got a couple more things to check. And I'll see you all tomorrow. There's the ball in. All right. We just have three strongholds. We just have Minnesota, Boston, and St. Louis. I will most likely finish these off stream so that we can dedicate tomorrow to events. We are currently at eight wins in the event. We need 25 to get Jason Dominguez. We will definitely get there. But I will make sure to have this conquest finished before our pack opening on Saturday so that we can have all the packs that are in this map present on Saturday. G to the G. With that being said, please stick around for the raid. I would very much appreciate it. Whoever we're about to raid will really appreciate it. But before we go, I know some people had some questions about collections and prices, so we will check them out. I'm just trying to get through this round real quick. Uh, Santa Quinn, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. Welcome on in. Hope all is well if we're from Oakland. <laughs> no, no, no. I'll ask if I need any suggestions. All right, we're probably going to head over to Boston. Let's fill in these gaps right here. All right, I'll fill in the rest later. So apparently there's a new collection for ball players. So we have batting perks you can collect. You have utility perks you can collect. And you have pitching perks you can collect. And here's what it kind of looks like. Jock is back. Later, later, later. No door on the internet. As for a live series, in case you all mi missed it at the start of stream, we did buy Acuna. So we just need Mookie. We have 60,000 stubs. So Mookie's at 45,000. And Tatis is at 91,000. We are saving up for Tatis. Our goal is to maybe finish this collection after our Saturday pack opening. Our pack opening, we're at 19 standards, three ballins, 10 TAs, and some headliners, and an unlockable. So I will make sure to finish the conquest, do our tops now, and we'll also get packs from the event. But it is looking like this pack opening won't be as big as the previous pack openings, but I will do everything in my power to get as many packs as possible in time for Saturday. Technique, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the Sand Squad. I hope all is well. I hope you all enjoy today's content. I will most likely uh, be playing more probably tomorrow morning right before stream. Not going to lie. I don't know if I'll have some time tonight to play it. But definitely tomorrow morning, I'll probably finish. I'll probably try to finish this conquest map before I go live tomorrow. We'll, we'll, we will be live tomorrow at our usual 1 to 4 o'clock p.m. Central Time. Saturday, though, Saturday will most likely be a noon to 3 stream. I will make sure to remind you all tomorrow, of course. But in the meantime, normal stream time tomorrow from 1 to 4. Most likely a 12 to 3 stream time tomorrow. And I think I have an idea 
about who we're gonna raid. We are gonna go raid hard pard. Please don't spoil the raid. But they're enjoying the new content. They're Stan Squad member, of course. They're playing some ranked seasons. Let's show them all the love, all of the hype, all of the good vibes. Thank you all so very, very much for watching. I really, really appreciate it. As always, please make sure you're taking care of yourselves. Be safe, be healthy, take care of the people around you, of course. And please don't forget to be kind. The world needs some more positivity. We can never get enough of that. But y'all are amazing. Enjoy the raid. I will see you back here this afternoon. Play all of the new content. I just hit uh, my microphone. Hope that y'all didn't hurt your ears. And I'll see you all tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching. Sand Squad is truly the best squad. Have a fantastic rest of your evening. And go Bucks.